picked up a new iPad Air 2. Just came out on the market. Open the box. Some little card here. Comes with one cable. USB. And one wall outlet. Power up for the first time. The card does tell you your volumes here, your, uh, sleep wake button on top, and your light controller and uh, home buttons here. Uh, so I'm going through the setup. password. And of course it's not going to connect because my wireless is set up for MAC address. So because the MAC address of this is not into my wireless it won't connect it. So it says I have to set up for iTunes. Well what I need is the MAC address. And since it's not giving me a MAC address it kind of makes it hard to set up. So I turned off my MAC address filtering on my wireless, which uh, is actually illegal in North Carolina. North Carolina requires you to have as much security as possible on your wireless, but that's not really relevant. So I'm going to put my password in. Okay, I don't like being tracked, <laughs> so I'm not going to use location services. And it is a new, I have no Apple ID, so I have to set up my birth date. gives you a slider that was close enough if I can get my finger in the right place my first name name mm, use your current email address yep now how am I going to use an old email address okay it won't allow me to put in my email address it wants me to create an iCloud email address it looks like I don't like having multiple email addresses because it's too much to keep up with And I have to create it. Let me put a password in. Okay, password in. Okay, next. The longer your password is, the stronger it is, no matter what the software tells you. And it's not going to let me because it's not smart enough to know that. Okay, Let's see if it'll take that one. Security questions. Second set of security questions. Okay, third set of security questions. 
Okay, now that I've got those questions all answered with uh, answers I won't remember, it asked me for my email address. Ray Rescue email address. I'll put that in. Okay. Email updates. Uh, sounds just like more spam to me. Terms of service. Now ask if I want to use iCloud. No, I do not. With any cloud, who owns it? If I have something sitting on there, who owns it? They can take ownership any time they wish. So no, I don't want to use it. Now, it asks me for a thumbprint. I'm going to tell it to set it up later. Create a passcode. And then re-enter passcode. Add a new credit card or debit card. Skip. Ask me if I want to set this program up to send my voice to Apple to analyze. Diagnostics and usage. Do I want to send my usage to Apple? No. Finally, I used up 16% of the battery just setting it up. And finally, we're at the page where we can use it and do something. Yeah, that's the setup on this. So now I've got to go find the MAC address and go add it to my wireless router.